import a script into your production, you'll need to switch your view to the script view. Here, if you haven't yet imported a script, you'll import a PDF file of your script by tapping the Import icon and selecting Import New Script. Select the PDF from your desktop and tap Open. This will import the PDF into the StageWrite app. This may take a little time depending on the number of pages in your script, but once it's imported, you can begin to create your calling script by adding cues and notes which are saved on their own unique layer. The lock icon allows you to move quickly from page to page by using the buttons up above or by using the go to page function. Tap the page number, type in the page you're looking for, hit go, and it will take you to that page. The view function will take you back to the chart view or to see charts and script together where you can link your charts with sections of the script. On the left side you'll find any charts that have been created for that scene and on the right side is the script. Just select a portion of the page and drag the chart that corresponds to that section of the page to link them together. This way you can swipe back and forth between script and charts as you work. Once you've imported a script you can import a completely new script and replace the one that's currently there or replace the current page with a brand new one without losing your cues and notes. You can also insert a new script page between existing pages or delete the current page and the notes on that page. Here's a page with a number of cues and notes on it. The writer has made an edit in the first line at the top of the page. So instead of scrapping your notes and cues, you'll simply replace that page with a PDF of the new one and you'll see the cues and notes have been saved and the writer's new line has been inserted. You can insert action onto your callbook by selecting the action function, selecting the corresponding words in the script, choose which side of the page to send it to, and enter the information and place it onto the portion of the script where you want to see it. Light cues can also be entered by using the light cue function. Select the cue word in the script, choose the side of the script to send it to, and enter the cue number. Additional text that you may want to include can be inserted by using the text box tool. Simply draw the text box, enter the information, format it however you need to, and place it on the page where you need to see it. You can decide to show or hide your notes by clicking the view tool at the top of the menu. Navigating between pages is done by using the forward and back buttons up above, or by using the go to page function to jump to a particular page. Your changes are saved as you enter each cue or note. PDFs can be printed here, and you can work on your settings here. Help and tutorials can be found here.